YouTube, what's up? It's your boy Crypto J coming at you guys with yet another J Talks Crypto. If you're brand new to my channel, hit the subscribe button as well as bell notification. I do my best each and every day to give you guys the top picks in cryptocurrency. And guys, nothing has changed. Nothing has changed. This is going to be an amazing, jam packed educational video. So if this is your first time uh, watching this video or your first time on this channel, again, hit that subscribe button, that bell notification, but also save this video um, into your saved folder so that you have this for later, just in case you guys need it. But today I'm gonna show you guys that are all getting started in cryptocurrency or that are trying to get started in this smaller micro cap market, how to make these type of gains, how to get started um, trading these meme coins and making these big monster 100x, 1000x, 10,000x gains. Because again, guys, that's the point of crypto, right? We want to make big gains and you're just not going to make 100%, 1000%, 10,000% gains on Coinbase. So again, if you guys appreciate this type of content, hit that subscribe button. But let's get right into it, guys. So the first thing that we need to do when we're trading on Uniswap is identify our ERC20 token that we want to buy. And what is ERC20 token? It's basically a token that's built on the Ethereum chain. So when we trade on Uniswap, we're only trading into Ethereum. I have another uh, video for Solana. You could go check that out. It is a very easy how to buy Solana coin video. Um, but as you could see, um, Ethereum is the top dog coin right now as far as uh, market cap. And so a lot of these projects are going to do very well. Some of these projects we've talked about on the channel quite a few times. You guys could see we talked about Pepe on the channel. We've talked about Trump coin on the channel. We talked about Mog. So some of these coins we've already been in to uh, in talks about. So let's just actually just take one of these coins. One coin that I really like is Trump coin. Again, it's not financial advice, um, but this is a project that again, 35,000 holders. It's still at 180 million market cap and it could have a ton of upside. And that's what I look for when I look for these coins. I look at, you know, possible good entry points. Um, always want to check the audits, right? You, you want to check your audits. So Dex Tools is really a great website to use um, if you guys are just getting started um, and looking for good, safe projects. You have to understand that not every project, guys, in cryptocurrency is going to be a safe project. Very important that you're checking these audits. So we could click right here. We could see uh, there's an audit disclaimer that comes with Dex Tools, basically saying that these audits are automatic. Um, some of them are. I don't think Honeypot.is is. Um, I think they actually take a little more time and go through the contract. So whenever I see that Honeypot.is is in here, I always feel a little bit better. But this quick intel, it is an audit. It's just like an automated audit. So it just really scans the contract. And then anything that might be of a risk, it might put something like this, like a little yellow, saying that there's like an anti-whale feature or something like that. Um, or if there's like something that's really concerning, like a honeypot, like what, what a honeypot would be is when you buy in and then you can't sell. So this would be red. If this is red, this is automatically, we're not going to get into anything that has a honeypot, anything where they could trade, uh, where they could change uh, buy and sell taxes. We don't really want to do that, right? We don't want them to change the taxes on us or to be able to um, change anything really on us. We don't want any of the coins to be mintable. We're not, we don't want them to be adding new supply, dropping the value, right? Because when you add new supply, you know, what happens to the value of the coin, right? Your coins are worth less because there's now more of them. It's the same thing as like when we print money. What happens when we print a bunch of money? Your money's worth less because we've just printed a bunch of it. So um, again, you want to pay attention to those things because they might be negative things in the contract that might uh, indicate that you might not want to buy it. Another thing you want to pay attention to when before we even buy these things on Uniswap, right? The whole video is to help you buy things on Uniswap, but I'm also showing you guys how to do your due diligence, right? So it says it right here. It's available on Uniswap. You could copy the contract right here, but before we even do that, guys, I think we want to do a little more due diligence on this coin just to make sure that this is something that we actually might want to uh, purchase. So we could see all the transactions that are coming in here. So you guys could see a lot of big or buy orders, a lot of big sell orders coming in. This guy dropping like 8K, this guy selling like 4K. Uh, but you could see these guys, some of these guys have been in and out of this trade quite a bit. And if you hover over this little uh, yellow thing right here, it'll tell you it's a bot or a smart contract. And so you might be thinking like, man, what's a bot or a smart contract? Well, let's, let's, let me show you. We could click right here on this wallet and we can open up this wallet right here. So as you could see, there's been 63,000 transactions coming out of this wallet uh, every couple of minutes even. This thing is trading. So it's a bot. It's not a real person. There's no way there's a real person that's trading this many times a minute and like going in and out of this many trades. So 
Um, this is a bot. It's a smart contract. They It's built on an algorithm. It looks for good entry points and stuff like that. You always want to make sure you know how many bots are in the trade with you. Because again, this let's say that this bot, right? Let's say that this bot is really one wallet, but he's really what he's really doing is sending all his money into different wallets to make it look like he doesn't own most of the supply. Right. That's why, again, we always want to check the holders. Right. Look at the holder count right here. So it says the holder count for Trump. The top wallet holds eight point eight percent. The second wallet holds five point three one percent. And the third wallet is a dead wallet. Right. So usually the dead wallet will usually be one of the top wallets. This is a wallet where they'll like burn coins into stuff like that. When they say that they're going to do a coin burn, they'll put those coins in the dead wallet. They'll, it basically takes the coins out of circulation. And again, when you take the coins out of circulation, there's less coins. What happens? Price of your uh, coin usually will increase or the value of your coin, I would say, would usually typically increase. Um, but as you guys could see, the so out of the top 10 holders, um, the remaining holders are holding 73%. So really the top 10 holders for Trump coin are holding more than 25%. Um, one of them is a dead wallet. Um, we do, I would want to like, if I knew that type of information, I would also want to know like, okay, who are these top wallets, right? It's, imp it's important guys. It's important that we do this. And honestly, guys, nobody else in cryptocurrency is going to tell you how to do this because a lot of these guys don't even know how to check contracts. They don't really know what they're doing. They're kind of new to this space, which is great. You know, it's, uh, it's always great to see new people in the space, but I just want to make sure that you guys are getting, you know, the right, um, the right information. So as you guys could see, let, let's see who those top, let's see who those top, uh, wallets are. As you guys could see, this is wormhole. So this is a, a this is a token bridge right here and this is MXC. So these are not, people's wallets these are like exchanges and then wormholes like a bridge it looks like um so and then look we talked about the dead wallet it says null right it says null dead so um sometimes it won't say null but it'll usually end in the in the word dead um and then that's how you know it's a dead wallet but so let's look at the first real wallet so this is the first real wallet right here this is a live person's wallet right here um, this person is the biggest holder of Trump as far as like a regular person. And as you can see, there is 10,000 transactions in here, which lets me know that this guy might be a bot, but you could also check all his coins and everything like that. So, um, yeah, that's definitely something that you want to pay attention to. So let's get back into it, right? We're going to buy something on Uniswap. Let's say we like Trump coin. Let's say it meet all the, all the boxes. We did all of our research. We checked their website to make sure how it looks to make sure if they have a roadmap, we checked their Twitter to see any development. We checked their telegram also to see how the community is doing. Now we're feeling strong about a coin. Now we feel like we did a little bit of due diligence, which again, I always tell you guys to do your diligence. So what we want to do copy this little contract address right here on Dex Tools, and we want to head over to uh, Uniswap. And then we want to go to, like it says, uniswap.org. We want to click launch app. It's going to take us over to here to this website, um, and it's going to ask us um, to trade Ethereum for whatever token it is that we selected. Okay, awesome, perfect. So the first thing that we need to do is um, get some Ethereum, right? We need to have Ethereum to trade into any of these tokens on the ERC20 blockchain. Um, so in order for us to buy Trump or a lot of these coins, if they're not listed on an exchange, then we're going to need to use Ethereum to buy them, right? And the way that we can know if, we're, if they're listed on an exchange is by going to the website. The website will usually tell you all of the places that this is listed on. Hopefully I got that. Wow, first try. That's amazing. So you could see um, it'll tell you usually all of the exchanges. So we know that, um, it's listed on, um, Bing X, L bank, Bitmart. Um, but then we also know that Trump coin is listed on MXC, right? Because we looked at the wallets, right? We saw MXC has a wallet in there. So MXC is another website that they have a listing on. Um, and as these coins get listed on big exchanges, guys, that's when they really pump. So that's the whole point of us being on Dex tools is to catch these coins, before they hit Coinbase, before they hit the big exchanges. Um, so I do like the fact that um, they do have some good credibility um, for Trump coin as far as like where they're getting listed and stuff like that. Um, so we want to go over to MetaMask as well. We want to get this MetaMask wallet right here. You guys can see I already have my MetaMask wallet set up. If you need help on setting up a MetaMask wallet, it's really easy, very self-explanatory, but I'm going to make a video on that as well. Um, and yeah, MetaMask is a wallet that you can use to trade any ERC-20 token. Also, you could trade on some other blockchains, um, but 
not Solana as far as I know right now Solana is not supported by MetaMask so if you're looking for a Solana coin you need to be trading on Phantom but if you're looking Ethereum we're using MetaMask so what we're going to do is use MetaMask we're going to connect our MetaMask to Uniswap just by clicking connect right here in the top right corner um, it's going to ask us if we're sure we are going to be sure we're going to make sure that we're sure by making sure that we are using the right website always make sure that when you connect your website, uh, your wallet, you're connecting it to the right website. Uniswap.org is Uniswap's website. So we're going to select our token after that, and we're just going to trade our Ethereum for that token. But you guys want to make sure that you also have enough Ethereum for the change. Each uh, each transaction is going to cost you a little bit of Ethereum. Um, Ethereum blockchain does usually take more than the other blockchains. Sometimes your transaction may be like 25, 30 bucks. Sometimes your transaction may be $5. Um, in times where a lot of people are trading, your transaction fees might be higher. You know, the most I've ever paid on a transaction was probably like $400, $500 just to get in a trade, just to have a chance to lose money. But that was a long time ago. That was before Ethereum 2. And a lot has changed in cryptocurrency since then. So transactions are a lot cheaper, but they're not free. So just understand that you're going to need a little bit of money for your transaction fee. Uh, have a couple dollars left aside. Um, but yeah, if you guys got anything out of this video, let me know in the comments below. Also, if you guys need any tutorial videos or you want me to make any tutorial videos to help you guys take your crypto game to the next level, just let me know in the comments section what you guys need to see a tutorial on, and I am going to give you a video on that. Also, if you guys are not yet tapped into my Telegram group, that is a free resource for you guys to be able to, again, take your cryptocurrency game to the next level. We got a lot of people in there that have already made six and seven figures in cryptocurrency. We'd love to meet you. We'd love to help you. Um, it's not a place for financial advice, but it is a place to learn things like how to purchase this coin or where you can purchase these things uh it's always easier i always say guys to trade as a team you don't want to be out here trading alone when you trade alone you're going to miss a lot of trends you're only as good as your brain um i get a lot even out of being in that telegram group myself even though i'm always in these charts even though i'm always looking for the next trend my team is amazing too. Those guys are just as awesome as looking at looking for the next top trending coin. So again, tap in with us on Telegram, guys. We want to meet you. We want to talk to you. Uh, and, and again, if you got anything out of this video, make sure you hit that subscribe button, that like button. It all helps me in the algorithm, guys. I appreciate you and I love you and I will catch you in the next video. Best of luck in this bull run. Peace.